You've used the words rigged and stolen about the 2018 gubernatorial election. You said it was proper because you can back it up. But a federal judge has now said the voter protocols that you challenged in Georgia, by his estimation, didn't violate the Constitution or the Voting Rights Act. New York Times adds this. The judge, who was nominated by President Barack Obama, added that fair fight action did not provide direct evidence of a voter who was unable to vote, experienced longer wait times, was confused about voter registration status. Do you take issue with Judge Jones' findings in this case? I take issue with the characterization that you've read. What the judge said in a 288-page decision was that repeatedly, under the Gringle standard, Georgia violated Section 2 of the Voting Rights Act. Under the Bronovich standard, which existed as of 2021, Gringles existed in 2020, and when we filed the lawsuit, Bronovich was the weakening of the Voting Rights Act that happened out of Arizona in 2021. And under the new standard, he did not have the authority to find that we proved our case under violations of Section 2. But he said that it was a racially discriminatory system. He spent copious amounts of time explaining how Brian Kemp oversaw a racist system that disproportionately affected brown voters. He said that while he was deeply concerned about what happened, he could not, under the Bronovich categorization, actually f hold him accountable. That is very different than saying nothing happened. And what we were able to prove in what took four months, what was the longest, longest trial on a voting rights case in Georgia in decades, the, the, what the court said is that he was not able to find that we could meet the standard under the new weakened Voting Rights Act. And that's the reason that I'm pushing so hard for the Voting Rights Act to be restored and expanded, but it's also why I'm running for governor. We need a governor who actually cannot be credibly accused of ha having overseen a racist system. And Brian Kipp, according to Judge Jones, oversaw and helped architect a racist voter sus suppression system in the state of Georgia. Well